Hello and thanks for watching. If you've been using JoinFS in the past you probably know that Peter the developer stepped back from it a long time ago now and there hasn't been any updates recently but I'm excited to say that uh, Christian Tuddux has been working on it and has released a version for Microsoft Flight Simulator 2024. So that's available from his GitHub page, which isn't very easy to find by searching, so I will put a link to it uh, in the description for the video. Uh, in addition to making it work with 2024, he's also made some other changes. Most recently, he has introduced a mathematical solution for smoothing out some of the uh, lags and jitters for close uh, across the network that affect close formation flying. Uh, he's put a picture here of the effect that it has. So uh, without the compensation, the same aircraft, once the data has gone through the network, is seen uh, in a different position and with the uh, predictive mathematical solution uh, much much closer. So that's very exciting. Um, this has temporarily uh, affected the recorder function uh, but Christian says that uh, he's fixed that and it will be working again in the next version. So uh, if you're not familiar with GitHub, um, once you get to this page, you will find uh, he's listed the assets here. So if you've got 2020, you click there to download the Microsoft installer. If you've got 2024, you click there. In addition to that, he has also uh, changed the way that JoinFS scans for models. This is my scan for models window, and you'll so um, in the past, JoinFS couldn't find a lot of aircraft in the simulator because uh, I think it's something to do with en encryption or locking of folders. I, I don't know. Um, so in the past, Pete had manually entered some extra aircraft in this column here, but. Christian has now added a whole load more. Absolutely loads of them so that JoinFS can find them. And on the GitHub, if you look in Wiki, he has instructions of how you can submit your own extra aircraft to a central list that is then um, downloaded to everyone's JoinFS. Uh, so this is uh, really exciting stuff. I don't know how much time he's going to have to dedicate to this, but fantastic that we've got it now for Microsoft 2024 and fantastic that he's introducing these other features as well. Okay, that's it. Bye-bye.